What are you laughing at? <laughs> Nothing. Why? I'm laughing at you dancing. Well, I in saw, silence. Well, I saw a comment that said they didn't like my dancing because there was no music playing. So I wasn't going to be footloosed. I want right. to. I want to dance. You would intro. not be contained. No, yeah, I'm dancing with that in mind. <laughs> Hello, friends, and welcome to this week's live stream. Hello. Happy Tuesday, you guys. Hope everyone had a good weekend, a decent Monday, having a good Tuesday, and if you're in a different hemisphere, possibly Wednesday. Yeah. I know it's Wednesday somewhere. It's always Wednesday somewhere. That's what I say. That's what that's what the calendar says. <laughs> it's um, not true. <laughs> after a very brief discussion with Carly about how this stuff works, we might be in over our heads, guys. <laughs> I'm just saying, I just want to preface the entire stream as early as possible. Yes. Yeah. Today, we are going to be testing out a custom instant, semi, quick, quick, <laughs> semi-instant yeah. ice cream slash sorbet maker that Tyler found on TikTok. Right. It made it into the title TikTok. Yes. <laughs> TikTok. We'll see after the stream if, if, if it stays in the title. It might get disqualified. Yeah. It might get nixed. The idea of finding things on TikTok and featuring them on this live stream might be nixed permanently <laughs> after this. Um, but we're going with it. Before we dive in. Yeah. Hi. Hello. Do you want to show everyone our mug of the day? Yes. And I'll see if anyone in the chat is up to anything. Yes. This one comes all the way from the Sooner State. It is oak. Lahoma. Yes, our Great. road trip Paranoid. mugs are starting to like get into the rotation of mug of the days. Look at that dude. Yeah, look at that dude. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, sir. <laughs> um, in the chat, Jess Carter says, "Hey, Sof, did you see the Bratz X Makeup Revolution collab?" The answer is yes. <laughs> um, we spotted it. We're gonna order it and probably do like a short form video with it. I was just talking on email with somebody about the Crocs, the stiletto Crocs. The stiletto Crocs. So we have a call. Oh my God, <laughs> the stiletto Crocs. So uh, in the uh, in the vein of bad makeup, we know we know. In the uh, arena of Frank, no collabs. No, in the arena of ugly clothing, there are more things coming out like the stiletto Crocs, <laughs> and we're working on it. And yes. we actually have another ugly clothing thing that will make it onto short form stuff that I'm working on too. So yeah. The Bratz Makeup Revolution collab we're definitely going to get, yes. for sure. I, although unfortunately I feel like we gave some of our um, Bratz clothing away. Not not the marquee pieces, like no. the, the purple faux fur jacket we still have, yes. but we'll, we'll make it work. And yes, the stiletto Crocs that came out today, we need, we need. Uh, a couple quick things. Slow mode is off. Oh my God, don't but, tell sorry, them. Sorry, but with great power comes great responsibility. And in addition, I figure like we give a quick update, like a <laughs> check-in about how everything's going on the main channel video. Um, I think we're, we're doing pretty well. Um, I'm not, we don't want to make too strong of promises because things can go awry rapidly. But it looks like we're on a good pacing to get the video done pretty soon. I think we're gonna, you guys are going to like it. It's really fun. Um, one thing about it is it's, in, it's filmed in this room and there's like different angles. And I have noticed people say before, they don't know the full context of this room. It's not very big. No, I know. But it's always, <laughs> we're always standing with this framing so you can see more of it. It's going to be cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's going to be a fun video. We're really excited for you guys to see it. Um, there are some pieces up in the air, but it could be out as soon as this weekend. Yes. Hopefully before the next live stream, actually. Yes. A couple of notes in the chat. Number one is there are people from Oklahoma in the chat. So hello to you. You are featured on Sooner this state. mug. Sooner um, state. Secondly, um, people are talking about the stiletto Crocs, which yet yeah, we, de we definitely need them. Um, and other people say it's Rosanna Pansino's birthday today. Oh, yeah. Someone asked me, um, Sophia Ludwig says, did you get Ro anything for her birthday? And interestingly enough. <laughs> in a way, yes. <laughs> in a way. <laughs> we may, we've, our next video for the main channel is a Franken video. Um, it's kind of like a random one, but it'll be fun. I hope you guys will like it. And we made like a mini version of the Franken that we made and sent it to Ro. Right. For her to film a reaction to. Yes. So is it a present? I don't know. Or is it a... A curse. <laughs> <laughs> but it did arrive around her birthday. Yeah, no, it did. Um, I, yeah. I mean, Ro did just an excellent job in our Franken cake video, giving us advice on how to build it and tasting all the flavors. Like, we had it truncated a lot because there were so many of them, but Ro gave us, like, in-depth answers and responses about 48 cake flavors. It was excellent. Yes, she is good at identifying scents. Yeah, she's excellent at it, yeah. So I'm, I'm expecting big There was big a things. lot of footage for that segment. There was, like, an hour and a half of footage, but it was fun, <laughs> and it ended up, ended up just being us, like, hanging out, which was really cool. So... That's kind of the rundown. Yes. Um, um, Sophia Audrey is spamming the chat. Did Tyler even find his belts? Which I don't know what it what means. What is that referring to? <laughs> so I'm just gonna, let's move on. Did you find them? I don't, I don't <laughs> know where. Did you? Oh, you maybe from the closet org video because I don't know where any of my belts are. 
in life. But Tyler, that video is like three years old. I don't wear belts, man. I wear elastic <laughs> linings. You know, and and when they finally, you know, completely <laughs> oh. appreciate, then I I don't have elastic linings, <laughs> okay. and I try what? <laughs> okay, keep going. Just finish. And it. I try to jerry rig the the, the the you know pant string. To okay, get here's one last thing before we actually try this. Yes. Cheyenne Lopez says I can't stop staring at the white dots on Tyler's shirt. Okay. So here's the thing: is so this is Tyler's shirt. This is Tyler's it's shirt. It's my shirt, yeah. Earlier today, Tyler hugged me while I was brushing my teeth, <laughs> and I got toothpaste on his shirt, and he went upstairs before this stream to shower and change, <laughs> but came down with the same shirt on. I like the shirt. So, <laughs> there's just toothpaste on his shirt. I'm going for that thing, you know when you like paint, and then you get like paint on you, and it looks, <laughs> looks kind of cool? It's kind of like, oh yeah, I was doing something. And now it's toothpaste, but it's kind of like, you know, <laughs> it's a look, right? I'm like, it's a rough and tumble thing or something. I don't know. Uh, but that is exactly what happened. Uh, it's toothpaste. It's toothpaste. Yeah, I like this shirt though. It's toothpaste. It's a, a is it a ringer? Yes. Ringer tee? Right? I, I like that, like, yeah. I feel like every stream we have to explain your shirt in some way. Or, <laughs> my, or my forehead. Yes. <laughs> right? yeah. I, Sarah Weber says, Tyler shirt explanation. <laughs> like it's like a regular segment. Well, like. I was I was driving to get like, our lunch and I was talking to my mom on the phone. Well, yeah, I was talking to my mom on the phone. Is this a good story? Well, it was funny because <laughs> she was like, yeah, she was like, um, she was like, uh, what did she say? She was like, uh, <laughs> she goes, you know, I was like, oh yeah, and I'm like really, I've, I've had a lot of caffeine, I gotta get something to eat so I can calm down a little bit. And my mom was like, well, you seem to not really care about that. Like you're, you know, like people say, yeah, your, your forehead's shiny and you don't seem to care. <laughs> so I think there's a lot of Tyler caveats, including yeah. that story. Um, okay, dude, I don't. Now people are begging for slow mode, so you know what, you guys, we can't win. Okay, <laughs> today is no slow mode. If it's horrible, the next week you'll get. I slow do see mode that back. Ben is in the chat, maybe, or maybe like someone's like just catfishing at ben, as Ben right now. No, there is someone right. named Ben, oh. but I don't think it's Ben Law. It could just be any Ben. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I also <laughs> noticed that Christine started streaming, which is super cool. Yeah, uh, that's awesome. She's got like. Lo-fi going on. It's like really fun. I don't know. I'm enjoying it. Okay. Should we do this? We should do this because let's do our yeah. experiment. Yeah. So <laughs> what we're doing here, as we mentioned, is we're making custom ice cream slash more like sorbet f flavors yeah. with the this machine yes. that we found on TikTok. Do we have the, the footage of the thing from TikTok? Here is the video that Tyler found on TikTok. Right. It is an Amazon product that you need. Look, you've got some frozen fruit. It goes straight in the top of this machine and it comes out as a sorbet. Right. And Whoa, that's I have fun to look at. It looks really tasty. Yeah. It doesn't look like just strawberries there. Oh, oh wow. wow. <laughs> that's the TikTok angle. Straight into the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Um, <laughs> so basically I think the way it works is you just stick frozen things in the top of this and then you like plunger it out and it comes out sorbet. Yes. Sounds right? Carly's yeah. nodding. Sounds right. Correct. I just, I just want to caveat. You shouldn't drive and, and talk on the phone at the same time. Okay. Oh, right, yeah. right. Sorry. Are you I caveating mean, that your mom was on speakerphone? Yes. Okay. I, I, okay. I, I, All right, okay. there you I go. I just want to caveat. <laughs> 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 okay, wait, so we should try this thing. Um, now, one dynamic is that one of these is the real one. Oh, <laughs> right? yes. So one of these things is a knockoff version from Amazon it, that we bought accidentally. Here's what happened. So after we saw that TikTok, Carly purchased one of the, the Yonana's ice cream maker from Amazon. Do we have the Amazon listing? Maybe? It's okay if we don't. Because no. I think we have, we have Amazon reviews to yeah. in a second. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> um, purchased one from, from Amazon. Came, it came, she tested it out. It worked pretty well. Then we ordered a second one to have on hand for the stream so we could like alternate between the two so we didn't have to wash one out every single time. Right. And we got a fake one. Yes. From Amazon. It's this a, it's, is the real one. This is the real one. Here, Ali, you want to see this one? See the, uh, this is the real one. Because they can, actually don't even have the same labels. You can tell by the spiral. Yeah. Incoming. Uh, you can kind of even see from here that the spirals aren't the same. There's like a different like thickness of the spiral. Um, yeah, see that's that's the this real one. This is the real one. This so is the wanna... real Yonana's, <laughs> Yonana's ice cream maker, right. and then this is the fake one. Right. So, it's a good dupe. Look at that. That is fake. <laughs> fake. And it says it on the boxes too. To be fair, so uh, it is not the, there. So we'll see if the fake one can hang, right? But maybe it's just a you know wish abomination, and it will not work. I didn't know, no idea. Yeah, so let's I have no idea. We're adding a layer of intrigue to this. So let's get to it. Okay. So oh, we yeah, have our bat cutting board. Bat cutting board. Yes. I'll open this guy up. How much do we need to go for? 
So you put the bananas in first, okay. and then the strawberries. It's supposed to be like a creamy sandwich kind of ah. deal, and then you put the bananas again. So I would just turn it on. Okay. Not now. When you're ready to drop it okay. in. Okay. And then drop it in, and then plunge. Okay. So Carly has warned me and that this thing. And put the bowl in front. <laughs> so okay, got so it. Yeah. It has somewhere to go. This 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 thing makes noise, so yeah, it could loud. be loud. Um, do, when when shall I read them the reviews? We can do that now. Let's do it. Yeah. I'm you want to do it now? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Great. Here are some choice Amazon reviews that Carly picked out <laughs> from this Amazon product listing. Ready? Here we go. Number one, five stars. People of the Amazon, I hereby proclaim this the greatest thing ever created. <laughs> Ten out of five stars. That is status legendary. Hi. It is a true marvel of science, magically producing perfect frozen yogurt from fruit. Yes, that's right, magic. Bravo, Yonana's inventors. Bravo. You are legends. Almost too positive. <laughs> that it feels fake. Like that this person is just like, you know, maybe it's it's it obviously could be the person making it. I like the or drama it. though. But I'm just saying it could just be like uh it's too positive. That's all. That I'm might saying. be almost too positive for it to be fake almost. Okay. All right, here's the next one. Yes. Five stars. It was fun. I really liked making fruit the ice cream with this toy, but it sucks <laughs> that you can only fill it half, and then if you push down, it starts to shake a lot, which scares me because I think the plastic tube is going to shatter, but it hasn't, so I can't be mad. <laughs> I would probably buy it again or give it as a gift. Gift status, and I also like fruit the ice cream. Might explode, <laughs> give it to friends. Right, fruit. <laughs> Colon, the ice cream, what really happened at Danger Beach, the Michael <laughs> Scott story. Yes. Um, we've got another five-star review. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Um, this is frozen love. There it is. This is frozen <laughs> love in cylindrical form. I almost let some of the reviews deter me from ordering this. Thank frozen bananas that I didn't. This thing is killing it right now in the reviews until this one, actually. I just noticed that there's a one star yeah. coming up. Let's okay. see what the negative so ones So those think. are the yeah. negative ones here. Yes. I'm not, those are the positive ones. Right, yeah. <laughs> those are the positive ones. Here are the negative ones. All right. TikTok made me buy it. Uh-oh, this is us. Oh, no. Yep, I saw this on TikTok. I could choke slam the influencer that raved about this machine. <laughs> Think about effortlessly feeding frozen fruit into this machine and smooth sorbet coming out. This machine does the exact opposite. I'm convinced you have to be bench press at least 250 just to get the frozen fruit down into the grinder. Then when it comes out, it's so chalky and crumbly in consistency. You'll lose weight for sure with this machine. I think I lost five pounds off my arms just getting half a cup full. Then starved because it could, took a good 30 minutes to get that half cup. Well, can you bench press 250, Carly? Because you were- No. Okay. Also, <laughs> I, I pressed so hard that it stopped working at one point. So maybe I can. Maybe, <laughs> maybe she can. Yeah, okay. Well, Carly, when was the last time you bench pressed or at least tried 250? Never. Okay, so we don't so know. So it's untested. It's Schroding Schrodinger's uh, bench press. <laughs> right? Like that it, could, it could happen. We don't it's know. It's possible. Yes. All right, here's another one. Garbage. Oh. One star. This Yonana's frozen treat made maker isn't fit to blend my dog's feces. <laughs> Well, that's just a weird thing you'd want to blend. Yeah. That reminds me of that Nathan for you episode where they made like a like a frozen yogurt shop that had a poop flavored ice uh, ice cream for you. Whatever. They're going for like the Refinery Twenty Nine article. Yeah, I, I actually have seen that in a Taiwanese night market that they do sell a poop ice cream, but it's just like a chocolate ice cream. And they give you a toilet seat like holder it goes oh. into. It looks cool actually. So if we go, so it's not poop flavored. No. Though. Okay, all right. But it is poop ice cream. I mean, to be fair. Right, right, right. Yeah. So it, it's bringing forth the imagery. Nathan right. for you is on to something there. Uh, here's the last review. One star. Fraud, do not buy. Okay, this is also what happened to us. Fraudulently misrepresented as Yonanas, the box came and it is actually Yonaus. They just flipped the N upside down and used the exact same advertising as the actual product. Very dishonest move. I think that's the real, oh no, no that's, the fake, oh, that's the fake one. This is the fake one. Yo now. Yo now us. Yo now, yo now. This is what your frozen dessert dreams are not made of. <laughs> See what I did there? Landed the Lizzie McGuire reference. Great. Okay. Um, <laughs> I just completely ignored you. But I, <laughs> <laughs> Great. Love it. Okay. Um, okay. So I think that we've done something. Uh, it apparently is quite loud. So we. I'm sorry to headphone users in advance. Slash. Are you ready? Yeah, I think so. Go. Oh, I'm going. Okay. What do I do? I don't know. I don't know. Why do you coach me? Why do you uh, give me some? How does this work? Bananas first. All Bananas right. first. Right. Should I turn it on? 
Yes. All right, do we have the action shot lined up? How, what's happening? We don't know. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good thing at bench press 250 here, guys. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I, I'm sweaty too today. Everyone's sweaty. OK, should I rock and roll? We good yeah. to go? Yeah. OK, here we go. Whoa! and then shake it. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Maybe there was just, um, you know, not enough in there or something, right? Maybe more, yeah. It seemed like there was gonna be a stream. Oh God. Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's, let's, uh, let's put more in there, what do you think? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, let's do more. Yeah. Okay, so. That was. <laughs> that was extremely <laughs> disappointing. Okay, yeah. so we did build the stream around this. Maybe we'll end up playing Google Feud. <laughs> um, <laughs> Who knows? Um, BB's Hamad says, why don't they have air conditioning like because it's loud in here. Yeah, okay? it, does, it makes We're a lot of noise. We're trying to save you guys the loudness. Yeah. Um, Holly says, why does it look meaty? Probably because it's like red and kind of like white, so it I almost looks like- I don't think any more can fit in there. <laughs> We're loading this up. Let's load this up. Like the raw best, meat? The best you guys can't see it is like Carly <laughs> pantomime I'm supposed to do. When we started going, Carly was like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, I have no clue what to do. <laughs> okay, uh, let's do it again, guys. All right, pardon the ears. Ready? Let's do this. Yeah, all right. Round. Strawberry and bananas, round two. Hard to. Oh. <laughs> Did I shorten it out? Uh oh. Just unlock it and then lock it again. Okay. Like um, the top. Oh. This it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah. Action shot. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 that actually wasn't so bad. That was almost good. TikTok made us buy it. And uh, it wasn't so bad. There's it, been a clump of bananas next to me that I've tried to put in both rounds and they keep getting just <laughs> completely neglected. Okay, time out, time out, time out. All jokes aside here. This is not so bad. This kind of yeah. looks, this looks a lot better than I thought this stream was gonna go about two seconds ago. Show, yeah. show Allie the, the creation. Yeah. It looks okay. That looks like it could be an ice cream adjacent thing. It looks like ice cream, actually. The banana does look like vanilla. I feel like I forgot to say this. This is supposed to be healthy because it like turns just frozen fruit straight into sorbet. So it's like just fruit. Like it's, it's just it's fruit like a, it's mashed like a up. frozen smoothie. It basically. does look though. Here, hold on. Let me get another action shot. This it does like look kind of like ice cream. It, in the it's kind of got like ready <laughs> backside of my spoon. You got it. See, like it's got like a smooth finish. Right? That looks kind of like ice cream. Oh, it looks kind of good. Yeah, it looks really tasty, actually. Um, Come on, the chat has to be surprised that we actually, actually got something out of BS it. BS says, you guys making meat paste? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, everyone just says it looks meat. But then some people are saying, Tapa C CIK says, ooh, that looks good. Moana OK says, this looks OK. Yeah. Yeah. Robbie yeah. Robbie says it looks like pink slime. So, A little bit. Let's A little see. Bit. All right, here, you want to get a spoonful, Saf? Yes, I do. OK. What are we going to do with, with my? My banana clump. It's okay. We'll All just right. we'll pretend it's not right. a thing. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, here we go. Not so bad. It tastes like a like unsweet smoothie. You know? It's it's surprisingly tart. Yeah. It is it's not bad. No. It's not like it doesn't taste gross. It's really cold. It's very cold. It's, it's frozen. Really, it's really cold, yeah. It tastes... Well, I mean, it you just... ate it. I don't <laughs> like it. Yeah, it, no, it doesn't taste anything like sorbet. Like, if you got this as sorbet, I think you'd be disappointed. You'd be like, well, okay, maybe a little sugar. <laughs> like, I'm trying to be healthy here, but I could use a little more kick. It tastes like... You're right. It tastes like a very healthy smoothie. Yeah, yeah. Like, this is like you just put fruit in a blender, and you blend it up, and then you just drank it. Mm -hmm. And that's like what it's... That's it. The shot from the TikTok, if we can go to the TikTok real quick, of the person who's eating it, right? They go in there. This is not the influencer. I don't need to choke slam this person. I don't think they really lied to us. <laughs> um, choke slam this influencer. That little, like, that really smooth one, I'm gonna call a little BS on, I'm not sure. They go in, they push it through, great. You know, this person here who's going straight to the face. Also, they use the bananas to really make it look like it was something Creamy, else. yeah. Yeah, this person, that's not how you want to eat it. I think it's just, it's a little too much right to the face there. I agree. But this is only frozen strawberries and bananas. What are we gonna do with my clump? 
Your clump's my lovely back lady in the clump. Yeah, you know, we just gotta put it right back in there. It's gonna freeze. It was okay. That was okay. It just tastes like tart. Like it's a little tartar than one would want sorbet to be. But you know what it is, maybe, and this could be it, is that for a traditional sorbet flavor like strawberry and bananas, it's not the perfect thing because you have something to template. Template. Eyes it off of. You know, I gotta. You're saying like, oh, I can compare this because it's close to normal sorbet. Yes. I can imagine normal strawberry sorbet and say this is not as good. But we have some alternative custom flavors that we're gonna throw at this thing. Oh, we haven't told them. Oh, that that's that, that's what I'm trying to set up here. Oh. But I'm trying to set up the premise suspense. here. Yeah, I'm trying to build we'll build the narrative. Mail. Yeah. <laughs> but I did, wait, didn't we tell them that? Okay. The thumbnail. The thumbnail. Oh, right, I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone clicked in from the thumbnail, right? <laughs> Did everyone see the thumbnail? Yeah. Well, we have, a, we have more things than just that, though. That's what we're saying. Yeah. So, this round, go wash that. strawberry and bananas. You gotta un unlock the top. Oh, yeah. Strawberry and bananas. <laughs> you know what? Turn it off. Oh, sorry, my bad. <laughs> well, hold on. I'll, I'll imitate the TikTok real quick. Ready? Oh, yeah, that's how I want to eat everything. No, that was a bad, was a bad bit. <laughs> <laughs> I was just watching you do it on the monitor, like, oh. Yeah, here we go. Thank you. Cool. Uh, we're Carly list for a second here, guys. <laughs> behind, the, behind the screen. When Carly's so. away, the mice <laughs> will play. Um, great, so Carly's going to wash out that thing. Should we, we set can up use the fake one. Right, should we sh try to set the fake Should we set up what we're doing for the rest of the stream, though? Yeah, absolutely. Because we tried the machine to get one under our belt so we know what we're doing for these next couple, right? Yes. So round one. Strawberry and banana. Exists. Okay. Yeah. Worked, but taste was okay. Next up, Tyler, you oh. have the cooler. Yeah, we I'm have this cooler up here. Carly put this cooler together for us. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Playbait. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, see, open it. Yeah, okay. And in here... <laughs> Carly put the child lock on for me. <laughs> Ooh. Um, Ooh, yeah, this one. This one right. next. This one Fine. next. Should we show what we have? No no no, 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 no. Oh, we got things in here that are prepped and ready to go through the machine. Because we're going to be making custom ice creams with this thing to see. Obviously, they're not ice creams. They're just purees. But we're going to see what we can make out of it. We do have a few that we've kind of like... We accounted for the lack of other flavors in it. So we're... Right? Because we're going to try to put some other things in with them so they'll go through the machine. All right? Can we do that? No. I take that back. Um, so, yeah. Next up is... Tomatoes. So we'll see how maybe you might want a frozen tomato puree, but regardless, we're gonna put it through and then we're gonna try it. We're gonna make frozen tomato sorbet. Yes. How do, should we try the fake one? We should try the fake one. Because this could be the one that like just makes people want to actually uh, choke slam somebody. And someone mentioned in the comments, not not uh, sponsored. No, this is not sponsored, not ordained in any way by- Oh, is this sponsored? No. No. No, it's God really not, no. yeah. God we just no. thought, we saw this on TikTok, we said, what else can we put through that thing? So, that's what we're going for here. Um, Mix everything together at the end. We can never do that. Yeah, oh, oh I guess we could. But I mean, it'll melt. No, no, the no problem. Like fresh ones, though. Oh, oh, oh. Do a oh, fresh round. Oh, yeah, obviously. Yeah, well, obviously. What am I thinking? All right, so we Yeah, try? we can do a Franco one at the end. How do I do this? Um, do you want me to oh, use the real one, Carly, Carly or the Carly. fake one? Then we should try the fake one. Let's try the fake one. If the fake one doesn't work, then we'll just, you know, it didn't work, and then we'll just call that round a, a, a there's, flop. There's no reason to believe that the fake one won't work. Yeah, right? Um, the frozen stra strawberries. The frozen tomatoes look a little interesting. Yeah. Here's here's the frozen tomato. Here you go. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. Okay. Frozen tomatoes. That's happening. Going in the machine. I mean, how there's no I? reason why this shouldn't work. Okay, let's think about the practical components of frozen tomatoes. Much, like, why would you want this? a frozen tomato ice cream? That was, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. Make a frozen pizza kind of thing? Oh. You're right? Pizza sorbet? I kind of like, like it. Like frozen pepperoni and tomato and, and cheese? Yeah. Cream? I, I kind of like Do this I spill thing. it to the top? That's what Tyler did, and it seemed to work. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. It did right. work, yeah. I think that honestly, um, Carly and I were talking about it. We're just talking about like what sounds gross that we could make sorbet out of. Yeah, tomatoes not. And way tomatoes off. was on the list. So I bring it down. People don't like tomatoes. And Allie doesn't like tomatoes, it's right? It's a fruit too, so no. there's no reason to believe it wouldn't work. Yeah. Exactly. So. Tomato is a fruit. All right, All right. how do I do this? You have to Turn it on. on. All right, people, this is yo na yo nows. Yo nows. <laughs> 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 Oh, 
Oh, jamming oh. soft. Oh. You're bench pressing 250 here. Uh. <laughs> Bending. Am I gonna have to choke slam an influencer? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is the yo now. So I don't know if that's their fault necessarily. <laughs> Is this just a fail? I would turn it off. Yeah, let's, do, let's and then uh, unlock it and yeah. lock it again. Do you want me to try to yeah. troubleshoot a little bit? Okay. Yeah, that was uh, that was uh, not the right sound. Yeah. Someone is saying we're making ourselves a a a bloody mary. Oh yeah. Or cold ketchup. Okay. The, the There's bloody a Mary's lot of sugar in ketchup though, I think. So this might. <laughs> <laughs> Something's coming out of it. No way. Shards. Is it because it's too frozen, do you think? Let me go run it underwater. You want to run it underwater? But this is also the fake one. Yeah. So it could and just be the fake one. Well, there's a way to test that. By putting it in yeah, there. Yeah, let's put it through the real is one. Is this one ready to just go again? I think so. All right, right. let's try it. <laughs> All right, Yonalis, you will not defeat us today. This was not an intended bit. This <laughs> we, didn't, not, we didn't know. We, we actually didn't were trying know to buy we had two a fake one yeah. until like yesterday. Yes. Uh, all right, we put this guy in. Put some in. frozen frozen tomatoes in there. Yeah. Yeah. They're yep. pretty solid. <laughs> They're pretty. They are. They are. They. I think that it could work though. I think the yo now so like might have just been the problem. Okay. <laughs> um. Yes. Yeah, C A L C says frozen salsa. Frozen um, salsa. Um. Les Petit says gazpacho. Gazpacho. Oh yeah, we'll be gazpacho. Um. Bella says literally though, mix it with Ready some kind of alcohol. It might actually be pretty good. Oh! See, that's a better sound already. Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> what was that? What just happened? It worked! What do you want me to say? It just worked. It looks like it made a snow cone. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. Did this work? <laughs> the announce is the problem. Yeah, look at that. Is that a thing? That's cool. That looks, that does kind of look like a frozen pico de gallo. You filled it up completely and that's as much as <laughs> No, I, mean, I really. <laughs> Do like one more round. Okay, we, have, yeah. we have a fair <laughs> amount of, of tomatoes. Do one more round. That was awesome. <laughs> that was <laughs> like throwing something into like a wood chipper. <laughs> that is what it is essentially. It's just a wood chipper. Mary Brum says, is the price of the machines different? Like between the yo nanas and no, the yo No, it was the same lifting. Too. Oh no, we, we got catfish too. So yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I think that we just got Amazon scammed, yeah. where we bought the exact same product again, and they sent us a fake one the yeah. second time. Okay, let's get a close yeah. in on this thing's uh, the exit point. <laughs> <laughs> I, the chat did not like that one for some reason. There's a lot of grosses in there. Yeah. Okay. Gracie Davis says, "Why do the tomatoes look crusty?" But they also use the capital C, as in like our cat. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I don't know where that's going. Lovely okay. says, "Where did it go?" Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Let's take a look here. Let's do a round two. Ready? Yes. I want to go to the action cam. Okay. Do the oh. Unlock it, lock it again. Oh, lock it, okay. Maybe I uh, broke it. You think? Oh, not! <laughs> oh. Ready? Okay. What happened? I don't know, Sophia. It just does. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to be like. Ready? Yeah. Can we hold it? Sure. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. Go, go, go. Yeah! Yeah! Yes! 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 Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you doing this? What's happening? Where did you go? No, no, no! no. I'm trying to do the TikTok. There's nothing coming out. No, you're right. Sorry. Sorry. Where did you go? I made a mess. Sorry. I. Did you flip the switch off? <laughs> Where did you go? <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. I, I told you guys, I had a lot of coffee today. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I was trying to do the TikTok thing where like, it, like they dispensed it <laughs> from there into the person's face. Okay, whatever. Sorry. I was just panicking. <laughs> 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 Okay. Okay, sorry about that, guys. So, <laughs> moving, forging ahead, forging ahead, we actually do have some... I know the chat has no idea what I just did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry about it, guys. Okay, so we did um, get it to work. Great. Here we go. Neil Loban says it looks like ground beef. We did make some tomato sorbet. Do you guys want to see our tomato? This yeah. look, looks legit, actually. You think this that looks, looks legit? Yeah. I mean, compared to our first round, that was just like literally a pile of crust. Right. 
This it is fl this one is um less smooth. It is like sort of icier and flakier than I would say the strawberry banana was. Yeah. But I mean it's pretty like I got like a whole thing. Okay. Wanna take a look? Okay. You can kind of see it, right? Yeah. Here yeah. Right. Tomato sorbet. All right, cheers. Let's try it. Here's some gazpacho. It's a, it is like really it's a frozen tomato. It's just like a tomato. Okay, I like it. Well, I heard like a tomato. I like this. This is good. <laughs> there is something, at first it's like snow, and then it's not snow. Yeah. And then it's a tomato. It's like a, a tomato snow cone. Yeah. Yeah. This is refreshing. It is, it does, it tastes like gazpacho. This is good. I like it. I can really like it. I think this is good. I like it. I don't know how much I could eat. Am I cloy? Yeah, I'm starting to tap out a little bit. <laughs> you gotta get some ranch. Just put it in there. Oh god, just like no. a big circle. No, 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 no. Um, um no, what does no, the chat no, think? no, 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 no. Is the chat angry with me? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, it looks like they've forgotten about it. Yeah, <laughs> Dirt says saw someone say to add milk or anything like that to like make it creamier or better. Yes. Um, we are gonna do that later. Yes. We're gonna do like a, mil a milky version of yes. one. But we're gonna I mix it up. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna try it. We just want to try some of these first ones. Uh, some of these ones that are like unconventional produce going into it. Yes. Yeah. That was not that bad. No, it's good. I would say that's like a six out of ten. Yeah. Seven, seven out of ten. This thing f is a one out of ten. Yeah. One out of five. I'm gonna choke. Sorry, I was gonna. This. I was gonna swear because I don't like this thing. But this thing is really. In I think that the negative comments about this one actually are accurate because it's yes. it's terrible. Yeah. Remy Sunset Sophie says Sophia is making this sound good, and now I really want some. Oh. Honestly. Tomato snow cones, not that bad. No, it could sneak its way. <laughs> yeah, Allie did not like the sound of tomato snow cones. Um, <laughs> Visible react. No. <laughs> so that was tomato. Yes. Um, funnily enough, in the chat, Morgan Williamson says avocado for frozen guac. Hmm. Frozen guac, frozen avocados. If hmm. only we had prepped hmm. avocados. Uh oh, there's one tomato out here defrosting. I'm gonna yeah. put that back in. And yeah, well, I didn't have it prepped, but yeah, let me go grab that that playmate, right? Playmate elite. I didn't know. Oh yeah, and we do actually have on that note, we have avocados. So frozen avocados. Exactly, uh, chopped and ready to go. And might I say. Carly did an excellent job dicing these things. Yeah. They look very tasty. And um, basically, a little bit in the spirit of, there's a video on my channel uh, a couple years ago that was where we went and got like, um, uh, you know, some custom made ice creams. And one of the things we got was an avocado ice cream because it was like, whoa, who's gonna eat, thank you, uh, gonna eat avocado ice cream. And it ended up being excellent because we like mix it in with the ice cream as vanilla ice cream. And then they put like potato chips with it. Oh, right. So it kind of tasted like, I don't know, it was really tasty, actually. It wasn't really like custom ice cream. It was more like unique ice cream. Right. So. But yes. Yes. All right. Hold let's on, let one. Try. Yes. So we saw, who was the person go. that requested uh, avocado ice cream? Morgan Williamson. All right. I'm not going to try to have this dispensed into my mouth like in the TikTok. You know, amazingly, things that happen on TikTok are not always oh, no. in touch with reality. So, Someone was telling me the fake one is dripping. Is it really? Yeah, it's fine. Do you want me to clean that one? No, it's okay. Just it's forge ahead. Yeah, Just that's why we ahead. got this table to be like a Food Network level height table, so that it could just take a severe beating. And I yes. feel like this is its first severe beating, as it has just like juicified um, avocado and tomato just going onto it. Want me to try this off? Yes. Okay, cool. Avocado sorbet coming up. Okay. A little tomato. Um, yeah. Leftover. Opal Kendall says Frank and sorbet. I beg of you. We definitely will. Yes. We're definitely gonna do it's a Frank and sorbet. At we the have end. some good for sure. Some good ones left here. So I think the key is lots. Yes. Right. Fill it to the brim. Did yeah. you show Allie how these look like just oh. frozen? No, like like pull one out oh, maybe. Sorry. <laughs> oh, no, you don't have to say sorry. I just thought it, I think it's kind of interesting to see how frozen it is. If they're really slippery, because avocado is like an oil. Yeah. Right, it's a, it's, it's a fat, an oily so, thing. Yeah, it's, so it has, it's, it, right now they're, like, they're kind of slipping. Look at hand. that clump. Yeah. What a clump. <laughs> what a clump. Christmas with the clumps. All right, uh, this is going in. Yeah, um, yes. People, I think, are more excited about the avocado one. Than the tomato? Yes. Well, people don't like tomatoes. 
Yes. So I think that this is, avocado is, I think, one of the most universally accepted fruits. I think also avocado does cross over well into dessert. As you mentioned, we've had like avocado ice cream before. Sharice Joy says we eat avocado as dessert in the Philippines. Definitely. Yeah. Other people are saying, like Cassandra Green says, tomatoes and avocados equal frozen guacamole. Yes. Um, uh, Shannon Jade also says, what would happen if you put meat in it? Carla, did you put meat into it? I put a frozen lasagna into it. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? That is some good testing. It looked like dog food. Okay, yeah. I didn't eat it. I don't think you're allowed to eat it. <laughs> because that, well, it wasn't cooked enough? Yeah. <laughs> I like how we asked, expecting a no. Yeah. I, I put a lasagna in there. <laughs> <laughs> what it like, and also like, what a complex thing to put in with all its layers. Just like, <laughs> was it at least like a hot pocket? <laughs> okay, um, let's. I think this thing's gonna is gonna give us a strong visual payoff here. Yeah, so let's get let's this do action it. shot going here. This is gonna be this is be good. Let's do it. I can I'm it. excited about Ready? the frozen avocado. I feel it in my fingers. I feel it in my toes. Avocados all around me. Yep. Ready and oh. All right. Here we go. Yep. Come on, you can do it. Uh, oh. Woo! Look at that smoothness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, do a little more. That was great. You Look like at that, that at the end. <laughs> it Are was you kidding? Smooth. It at the really end? Yeah. yeah, it looks smooth at the end, yeah. man. Yeah, green ice cream. Yeah. We could open up a food truck in New York. Yeah. <laughs> what do you serve, sir? It's avocado. Is there anything you do with it? No. We just put it into this machine. <laughs> we just shoot it out. Whatever. That'll be nine dollars, please. It. <laughs> just in there, just shaking it like this. Like Carly's just washing them out. We're going one after the other. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Um. People say Samantha Speak says gross. Ha ha. Um. <laughs> Imagine um, someone clicking into this live stream like right then, be like, yeah. what is even <laughs> happening? No, I think the avocado is actually good cream. and creamy. Because yeah. Lemon Drop says the avocado is thick. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> um, Stephen J says, I'm not happy. Really? Um, In general, or Colleen, just like this? You Colleen, know? <laughs> Colleen Useti says, put it on toast. Okay. Frozen avocado on frozen toast, baby. <laughs> um, this is great. This is, yeah, I agree with Margaret Russo. This is simultaneously fascinating and gross. I completely agree. Right. Yeah. Okay, you wanna do round two? Yeah, let's do, do round two. Do you wanna do it? Sure. I don't think I'm good at it. Okay, I'll do it, I'll do it, it's fine. This, uh, this is less about who can do it. This is not a teamwork about, thing. <laughs> <laughs> this is a run. No, so it's, I'm holding it for you, it okay. is a teamwork thing. All right, let's but do it's it. less about like, it's more, let's get the product. Yes. All right, yo, Nanas. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Oh, ah, yes. Woo! Oh, there we go, there we go. Yeah, yeah. You got this. Great, that's it, right? Yeah. We got some extra tomato in here. Uh -oh. Some leftover. So anyone who wanted the guacamole <laughs> angle right there, uh, we got a little tomato right there. Yeah. People are saying it looks like wasabi. It, this actually definitely looks like guacamole with the tomato in there. Yeah. Um, Jamie G says it looks like wasabi. Why is it like dealing with a car that's having a backfire the whole time? <laughs> Everything is just like shaking. It like goes silent and it has just an extremely loud noise. And then it's like, well, it's a blade or some kind of purifier. So it's like, is this dangerous? You have to work for your sorbet. Exactly. For your disgusting avocado sorbet. I'm going to lose five pounds for my arm like that one person said. Right? All, right, all the uh, you know whatever. Your spoon is down there. All right, cool. You can use my spoon, but we just do. We need two spoons. All right. I kind of like that tomato thing, actually. Did you, Allie? Did you get to see this in its full glory? Look at that. It's kind of sheety. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Like like sheet like yeah. like there's sort of like like layers to it like uh, not layers but like it kind of comes out in like a a sheet. A, sh a sheet is right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Ready. Yeah. Honestly, it looks so creamy and good. Yeah, I, I will say it, it looks great. Our plates, our bowls make the most annoying noise. Sorry. Yeah, I, I hate them. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. I hate these. Plates. Sorry, guys. I hate these bowls. We got them from our registry. They're, they're 
It, we, you know. But thank you to people who bought them for us. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a, we chose it. It's not like it was because you choose the online listings. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cheers. All right, cheers. No. <laughs> no. Mm. <laughs> no. Mm. Okay. <laughs> the texture is like an eight out of ten. <laughs> the texture is very, very good. The problem is, avocado, plain avocado, is very, like. Savory, you know, like umami esque. Umami only. Like there's like something weird about just like a plain avocado, right? So I think that if we had sweetened this right. with like sugar, Maybe balsamic. it would have balsamic, you said. <laughs> with sugar, it could uh. be really good. It's it's or a the aftertaste is is truly awful. Coating my mouth. Oh yeah. Here's what here's what I think it is. Is that A avocado has a subtle flavor. And this is bringing all of it out. It's like a popsicle avocado. Right. So it's only that flavor, so it's overpowering. And also that avocados are a fat, right? Yeah. So it's very, very, very oily. So it's like we just did a coconut pool, or one of those things, right? Oh. A coconut oil pool, but we swallowed it. <laughs> I Do you know think, what I'm saying? Are you here to rinse it, Carly? Yes, it here does taste a little bit like a guacamole, like a purified guacamole, yeah. I'm gonna try a little bit more. How do I do it? Oh, Help the second one's worse. I gotta wash it down. Wow. Help me. No. Um, no I, I got it. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> like how many of disembodied Carly arms. <laughs> um, yeah. I, I think that, so for the avocado sorbet, I think I, did you mention that it could also go the other way if we had made it like saltier? Yeah. Like if we had done like, I don't know if you want to put onions in there. Balsamic is what I'm talking about because you have almost like a, it's a thing. Maybe you put even just like Cholula on it or like yeah. pepper on it or something, it could be good. Like just something to like change the flavor slightly. That was the, the grossest thing we've eaten on the stream so far. That was gnarly. I, I include the ghost pepper thing. Natasha Slocum <laughs> says, avocado, oh no. <laughs> um, Kulsum Mukhtar must have missed the beginning. They ask, what happens if you put normal fruit in it? Comes out okay. Yeah, I, I, I got some down here. Actually, yeah. you could use it as a palate cleanser right now. Ooh, it although looks like this. people are kind of implying that the Franken one could be good because banana and avocado are good. Yeah, Maya Madhu says banana and avocado this together. Thing, this thing is solid. This gruel looking stuff. Oh, oh God. Why are you, where did you find <laughs> no, that? It's on the ground. <laughs> What's happening? Um, great. All right. So. Let's do the next one. Yeah, what is next? This is the avocado. The avocado is going away till later when we do our Franken. I'm actually at this point about like uh, several of these in. I'm surprised that any of these have worked because that first little bout, I was gonna be like, well, we're gonna have to end, end the stream after like five minutes because this is not gonna go anywhere. Can you help me? Yeah, of course. H oh no, actually, I figured it out. Okay, never mind. Um, yeah. ah, ha, ha. All right, here's the next one before the grand finale. Okay. This one, we're going, uh, is a cucumber a fruit? It, it is, right? It's you got spoiled seeds. It. Just kidding. Well, anyway, it's cucumbers. Yes. Because we're going, you know, I don't know, something that we felt like could work as a puree, right? Cucumber puree sounds like a thing that could be given to you at a spa. It actually sounds like it could be like very refreshing, yes. right? And cucumbers are pretty tasteless. They have a taste. No, they have a taste, they have an, an aura. Yeah. They, they have, a, they have like, a, like a vibe. They have a vibe. Right? Okay, I kind of get what's going on. Cucumbers right? have more of a vibe than a taste. Yeah, because if you really think about it, at point of tongue, you know, a point of contact, it doesn't really taste like anything. Right. But your mouth tastes something. Yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to move on to the cucumber, the frozen cucumber section. The frozen cucumber sorbet. Thank you, Carly. I can just sense, like, Allie, like, just losing any confidence in my ability to deliver a coherent sentence. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of just watching and being like, yeah, I don't think, you should just stop. <laughs> All right, here, let's use this one. I think I've have front loaded this stream with a lot of stupid comments. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, we'll see if I can I mean, it if on a people, high note. people, stayed through you diving underneath the table trying to eat it from like where there are no cameras. I think that was a solid bit, okay? <laughs> <laughs> to be completely honest with you, I thought that was just me committing to the stream right there, okay? Yeah. Because, um, I, I mean, come on, when you see them doing that, you're like, okay, can you actually just, what's, what's going on, Carly? I just, 
the chat is just full of Carly reveal right now. <laughs> <laughs> Did you walk in front of frame? I don't know. <laughs> oh, maybe. maybe. they're asking for one. Oh, okay. you oh. Carly, you're in high demand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they got a little taste of the hand. They need more. <laughs> Carly just going. <laughs> it was a little scrunchy, I think. Just <laughs> shaking it, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, so, yeah, cucumbers, frozen cucumbers. I think they could have some potential. Um, and then we have, then after this, we'll have two more. It looks kind of good. Franken. Look at that. It's it looks like a little slimy. It does. But it looks also kind of good. It, this feels like a Juicero thing. Like, it could be, like, something someone could peddle. Like, oh, you take a shot of this. You know, like, it, it, it doesn't seem impossible. Not to mention, I think that it being very watery could play to its benefit, right? That it becomes more like a like a slushy kind of thing. Yeah. I agree. I think yeah. it's going to be, I think it's going to be good. Okay. Because I so far, my favorite one has been the tomato. Yeah. And I feel like this could be, like, a more subtle, more refreshing version of that. Yeah, I, I know what you're saying. Where it's not really creamy. It's just sort of, like, ice. Yeah. But it's good. The avocado was a letdown. I gotta be honest. I, the avocado was was real. I I know that it's not a good thing to spit something out, but it was uh, what was on my mind as I was eating it. <laughs> I think that you could make it work. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't know. Okay. Anyway, so here, let's do this. Okay. So we have this in here again. Right. When we hit this switch, we don't know what's gonna happen. But if we hit it and it's loud, we're giving you guys a heads up now. Ready? And let's go. All right. It's going on. Okay, ready? Oh! Ah! All right. Yes! Uh-oh. We need more. We need more. Fill her up. All right, fill her up. Yeah. Wh why did some explode out you, of the top? The reaction you guys heard was because some of it exploded like a chimney stack. Why did that happen? Out the top, yeah. Um, I have no I, idea. Well, I think it, yeah, it just Here, rattling all over want. the place, yeah. Oh, it smells kind of good, honestly. It smells spa-like. It, I kind of just want to like suck on one of these. You mean this thing? Ready? Yeah. Right? Like. It smells good. This thing. Exactly. Well, are you gonna put oh. those? Are you gonna put those in the thing? <laughs> He's putting trying to put cucumbers on his eyes, but they're oh, not yeah. in circles. They're anymore. very cold. Yeah. Is it they're stick to your skin at all. Oh yeah, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> A little Dumb and Dumber moment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's put Tyler's eye cucumbers to the side. Yeah. No one wants those. They got a bunch of uh, <laughs> uh, those eye creams that we're using. <laughs> all right. Anyway. Ready? All right. Oh, mm -hmm. here I got it. Yeah. All right, there we go. There we go. We're back in play. Come on. Yes. 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 Absolutely. That was pretty good. Yes. Yes. Can Absolutely, I, I do. Can I interest you in some cucumber sorbet? Yes, I'm interested. You have my attention. Although, why are there two completely full whole ones in there? I don't know. Like, they literally right oh. there, oh, they they're like two through? completely whole ones. And they're good. They're yeah, they're ready for my eyes. Yeah. Just go right back <laughs> on now. Um, it kind of... Oh, okay. A lot, sorry. We're eating. A lot it's of this just reminds me of, like, uh, in Arrested Development when, uh, what's her name, uh, when Lindsay is making hot ham water. <laughs> where she just like takes ham and puts it in water and heats it up and she's like making a soup where it's like it's not really like there's nothing happening we're just like putting it through a machine and we're like well now it's transformed it's like yeah it's chewed already I don't know what you want me to say <laughs> people are saying that like to this we could have added like watermelon or honeydew to make it like more appealing um, uh, Brittany Smith says watermelon would have been a solid choice I mean yes but at the same time we're not here for a good time. I feel like it's meant to handle watermelon. Yeah, exactly. We're here to test the limits of this machine. <laughs> right. Well, it's kind of like we're getting some good um, Food Network tips. Here's right. a tip. Right? Here's a tip. Here's Add a watermelon. Tip. <laughs> no. Make real food. I want to make only bad things. All right, dude, this looks honestly good. I think I'm going to like this. You're going for a really, really big spoonful there. Th I'm going against the Food Network star recommendations. I'm going for a big bite. Yeah. Spoon Ready? spoon? Cheers. All right, cheers. Cucumber to the face. A lot of fuel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. It's also, the, I think the missing component is the fact that it's frozen. I know that that sounds so obvious, but every time we go in, I'm like, oh, it's really cold in my teeth because it's supposed to be an ice cream. Okay. The cucumber taste 
is good. Yes, actually it is. But the peel is very leafy. Right. Like the peel is a little tough. Oh yeah. Almost like sort of like, it tastes a little bit like a broccoli stalk when mm -hmm. it's quite frozen and hard like this. It's all the so, broccoli stalk, none of the fun head. <laughs> no. I know what you mean, yeah. yeah. I think that if we perhaps like peel the cucumber before freezing, it would just be like fun, light, spa-like snow. Oh, yeah. But with the peel, it's a bit... It's a bit broccolier than one would want. <laughs> unlike unlike the avocado, though, the aftertaste is quite delightful. Yeah. It's, it's, very, it's very fresh in my mouth right now. I feel very refreshed. Um, and I will say, the snow thing is right. Yeah. You want it to be snow. You don't really want it to be a smooth thing. Because I think the snow is kind of like where you get like a more subtle flavor. And that's the, the water component. What's up? What's going on? Greta Joe says, why wouldn't you peel it? I was like, I don't, we didn't think of it. We didn't think of it, I don't know. Oh, you just go, what do you want? <laughs> this one's the most potent smelling one out oh, of yeah? all of them. Yeah, this one, the cucumber juices have been released into the air. After we just crapped all over cucumbers having no flavor. <laughs> like, it's uh, quite it's fragrant, it's got a lot of taste. I mean, it is probably a much better aroma than our Franken Febreze candle from last time. That was pretty intense, actually. This is pretty weird. Honestly, I, I'm pl I don't love eating the peel, but I like being near this. You wouldn't make this to eat. No, I would make it minus the peel. Okay, so I think we're coming up on Ooh, our- I, Did you see me take that off? I did, it was, a, it was, it was oh, impressive. Oh, sorry. Let me just get that. Okay, keep going. What was that? I was very impressed with myself <laughs> that I was able to dismantle the machine so quickly. So we're on to our penultimate one, um, which is act, which was originally prior to us considering doing the Franken one, our, our last one. Yes. Um, but I do think that the Franken one's an excellent idea, especially because we have a Franken video coming out soon. It's yes. fun. Um, is, can I say it or do you want to say it? No, you can definitely say what it is. Actually, I don't even know if we have it. What is it again? I just I, I was I wasn't sure like what how much of it we're doing. It's it's the it's the, the thumbnail one, right? Yeah. It's the it's the it's I don't know if it's flaming hot, but it's the Cheeto one. It's flaming hot. Flaming hot Cheeto one. We're gonna put that through, and we're gonna try to make a like sort of a replica of a freight flaming hot Cheeto ice cream. Do we have other things to put it through with? Is that what we're doing? So here's what's happening. Yes, this is what I'm asking for. So you to step <laughs> in. <laughs> so now we're done with the cucumber one, which yes. I thought was decent. Yeah. We're moving on to the. Flaming Hot Cheeto ice cream. Yes. Now, we actually went to get like actual Flaming Hot Cheeto ice cream on your channel a couple of years ago yes. in Orange County. It was very good, we liked it a lot. So when we found this like custom ice cream making machine, we thought, why not try and make Flaming Hot Cheeto ice cream? Yes. At that time, we didn't know that it was basically just take frozen things and put it through. Like I thought there was some like ice cream making machinery, like like actual, component inside. Yeah. Um, so if we had frozen, straight up just frozen Flaming Hot Cheetos, it would have just come out like dust. You right. know what I mean? It would have just come out like, like a sort of- Shards. Shards, exactly. So what we did is that Carly mashed up Flaming Hot Cheetos into yogurt. Is it yogurt? <laughs> yeah. Into yogurt. And we froze them in logs. We gotta show, we gotta show everybody this because these are almost like like flaming hot Cheeto yogurt flautuses. Yeah, they're like taquitos. <laughs> yeah, they look awesome. Um, so basically, should we go to that? Yeah, if you see, they're basically in here are like the things that will be going into this bad boy. And as yes. you guys have seen, that hasn't gone that well. So we'll see how this goes. No. Um, you might want to eat. Carly is battle tested, given that Carly has also put a lasagna through it. Um, so basically. The thing that they that made the flaming hot Cheeto ice cream in Orange County was called like drill. It was like a drill. It was like really high impact to really mash it together. Yes. And obviously, we don't have that here. But we're gonna try to see what happens and try to make a impromptu um, flaming hot Cheeto ice cream. Well, I think that Carl already mashed them into here. All right. Should we show? Should yeah. I? Can I open one? Yes, you can. All right. Here's the reveal. Da -da -da. Oh, this me. thing looks awesome. Look at that. It's a flaming hot log. <laughs> okay, wh where Doesn't is it? Doesn't sound good. It's yeah. Somewhere in here. Oh yeah. That thing looks amazing. Kind of looks like a peppermint stick or something, like it peppermint does. bark. It's flaming hot Cheeto log, baby. All right, Tyler, it's all Look you. It is. We could freeze these things. We could pack package these things, send it to people. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Let us know if you want one. What kind of uh, yogurt is it, Carly? It's like vanilla Greek yogurt. Oh. So it's like a little bit sweet. Gotcha. Exciting. Oikos. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, cool. That's interesting. 
Uh, great. All right, so I'm gonna unpackage this thing. Saf, do you want to do this? Yeah, everyone's everyone's upset about this. Why? Uh, uh, not like um. <laughs> not not really. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> um, some uh, David says it looks like a crab leg. It does look like a crab. Um, it looks like artificial crab <laughs> from sushi. Yeah. Can I interest you in a California roll? We have everything you need. We have cucumber, avocado, and this. Sarah L says <laughs> that's straight up unholy. Wow. Yeah. I think this is a good idea. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm kind of surprised. People think it looks, actually, Gracie says, why does that look good? So, <laughs> Maddie wants us to take a bite of one of the logs, but I think we should, let's, let's, let's get Let's some, get there. Let's get, let's get there later. Oh. Oh my goodness. All right, let's, uh, oh my goodness. Okay. Go for it. Here we go. Ready? Yep. We're doing this live, people. Yep. Oh God. It smells good. Does it? Yeah, I, I smell. All right, ready? Yep. They coming. That looks awesome! That's amazing! Holy well. Oh, okay. Dude, this, this is what the TikTok should have been about. This is <laughs> awesome. Here, let's This do, is content, people. Let's get one more in there. <laughs> Look, this thing is just getting everywhere, too. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be good. It smells good, too. The vanilla was a good choice. I will say, the Flaming Hot Cheeto ice cream was good. Yes. Uh, it was cool. Like, they actually work well together. It's kind of like, and I said this in that, that vlog, they, there are like weird food combination videos that, where they team Cheetos with milk a lot, like a cereal. Yeah, yeah It's yeah, very yeah. common, because it's just like processed Cheetos, which is just like cereal, just like with a slightly different thing, and it's just dairy on dairy. It doesn't really have any downside to it. The only thing is there's a little bit of paper stuck on this one. There is some paper one. on it, yeah. <laughs> Should we just put it in? Well. No. No. Okay. <laughs> we'll just take a bite out of that one. Here, I'll get one out, so here, <laughs> hold this. <laughs> oh, why am I doing such a bad job all of a sudden? All right, ready? Because I think, yeah, it's got to roll it out like this and get it, there might be some ice there. Jan T says, as weird as this is, I think it's the closest they got to ice cream. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> That's definitely true. <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't really do a much better job. I think we should just put it through. All right, we're yeah. eating a little bit of paper. Yeah. I'm sorry It's all everyone. good, people. This thing is like really, it's like really on my hands. Okay, let's do this. Ready? Ah! There's paper towels. Ah! Oh. That's okay. All right, ready? Go. Ready? Go. <laughs> the big cam, just let me sing, sing out like that. Okay, ready? Yep. All right, let's show how it goes. Ready? And... Yes! Yes! <laughs> Any more? Done. That's... <laughs> Great. Oh, you got to cut out right as you're yelling yes? Yes! <laughs> Here, here's some napkins. Wow. That smells like Greek yogurt. <laughs> I think it smells good. I know, I mean, I like Greek yogurt smell, but it smells like, remember that uh, Greek, frozen Greek yogurt place we used to go to in uh, the Glendale Galleria? Yes. Uh, it was very good. I don't remember the name of it, though. I d actually, I don't know the name of it. <laughs> the name of it just flew out of my head. People say it, dis it looks disgusting. Um, uh, but honestly, I think it looks good. Yeah. Yeah. Let's take a shot of that. Yeah. Yeah. I think it looks pretty good, yeah. Someone says, this reminds me of childbirth. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about that. Um, how? I don't know. <laughs> what, what possibly reminds me of childbirth? Uh, <laughs> uh, cool. <laughs> okay. But, hey, where's my I got spoon? a piece of uh, cucumber peel at the back of my throat right now. It's very unpleasant. Yum. <laughs> okay. All right. Did we see how it looks? Yeah. Great. All right. Ready? Oh, this smells good, and it looks good. It, it looks, smells awesome, actually. It smells good, and it looks good. Oh, I have very high expectations for this. Cheers. Cheers. I, yep. <laughs> A lot of Greek yogurt. <laughs> I think I got some paper on that one. I got paper, too. OK. <laughs> I'm getting to the Cheeto part. It's pretty it spicy. It tastes like. Spicy Rice Krispie cereal. That's what it tastes like for sure. It tastes like cereal. It's like it's like a bowl of like puffed snack plus dairy plus spice. It is like a spicy bowl of Rice Krispie cereal. Not a Rice Krispie treat. It's I not sweet enough to be Rice Krispie. I had to get some of the paper out of my mouth. Um. Oh, get over it. <laughs> <laughs> you wimp. You softy. 
Here's what I'd say. Because I can't really go back on the face I made when I first put it in my mouth. It is <laughs> on camera. I've been caught in 4K. Um, but, We're not uh, shooting in 4K at all. In a <laughs> I, We're I, barely in 1080. <laughs> I got caught in 720. <laughs> 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 um, uh, it is a. Uh, it is incredibly gross on first bite for me, but as I progress through it, I actually enjoy it a fair the, amount. The yeah. initial taste is very, Greek yogurt's got like a sharp thing, it, right? It, yeah. The initial sour, bite. Sour, sour taste. Sour, right, right. It's got a little, it's got a little bit of that when you first bite into it. The aftertaste is Rice crispy burn. A slow burn of Rice crispy. As cereal. you get, yeah, as you get to the Cheeto, this is really, this is the confirmation that Cheetos are dope. Because as you get to the Cheeto, it wins out despite being just, you know, dairy eyes. I can't tell if the texture is good because I'm getting a lot of paper or if it's like the crunch. No, it's congealing. There's, there's this, like a crunch to it, isn't there? There's a thing that happens in your mouth where I think it, 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 it I think it, it, it. It's basically a snap crackle it pop. It pasteizes, <laughs> like paper, you know? It, like it becomes a paste at some point. Oh, what you're saying is like, it becomes like a wet Cheeto. Yes. So you think it tastes like a soggy Cheeto? No, I think mean, this. Well, I can't tell because literally, like right now, I think I have like a, no, I a know ball of paper, like a spitball no, no, in my I mouth. I don't think yeah. it's paper. I don't yeah. think it's paper. I know what you mean. Yeah. What happens is you eat it, <laughs> then the Greek yogurt melts. You're left with a bunch of flaming hot Cheeto, which then sort of becomes reforms <laughs> into a Cheeto in your mouth, but now it's soggy. So now you have a soggy Cheeto in your mouth. As dumb as that sounds, yeah, I think that's what's <laughs> happening. <laughs> <laughs> that is, yeah, that is what's happening. <laughs> There's like a part where it becomes, yeah. Great. I like this. This is almost ice cream. This is close to ice cream. This is, I think that I like it. It's almost ice cream. It's almost ice yeah, cream. Yeah, I agree. It, it, it's, I mean, obviously, it's like it's just dairy mixed with something. <laughs> I can't believe it's almost ice cream. <laughs> All right, great. So now that that's tested out, <laughs> first of all, I think we should give some props to Carly for this. Dude, Carly horror. deserves a ton of props. <laughs> I mean, this this thing is awesome. This log. This log. <laughs> Apparently, the audience finds it troubling to look at, but I think it's an excellent presentation. Bless this log. As they might say on a Food Network show, the presentation is impeccable. <laughs> <laughs> um, Here's a tip right. when you're trying to blend up your Flamey Hot Cheetos ice cream thing. Listening. Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> what happened? Um, I don't know. <laughs> all right, I am going to cl try to just clear out one of these bowls really quick to make a Franken. Yeah. There's another bowl in there. Oh, there's another bowl? <laughs> Great. Oh, uh, let's try, uh, while we're doing that, uh, we should probably clean this guy out because we're going to use this, right? Or we could just not and just let it ride, oh. right? Does it need to be clean, do you think? I think so. Okay, okay all right. Okay, okay, never let's mind. Let's rinse it really quick okay. and just do while the Franken. While we're doing that, we'll do a segment I call Tasting the Log of Greek Yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> so, given that you guys wanted to see this, I mean, it's right here. A lot of people wanted to see it. Yeah, Ben yeah. Hare says, "Bite." Ali May says, "Bite the log." <laughs> that is a that is a, a hand reveal. <laughs> what just happened? I tried. You, what you guys don't understand is that Carly's actually just the parents from uh, Cow and Chicken, where she's just she's just, she's just a pair legs. of arms. Yeah, <laughs> so she she's appears, just limbs. Yeah. We've never even seen her, so <laughs> <laughs> we don't know where she is. <laughs> Um, yeah, Bjork Cold says chomp the log. Mer okay. Mergine says bite it. This looks like a def like a like a just like a terrifying uh, like Nutrigrain bar. I was gonna <laughs> say it looks like a like a peppermint <laughs> stick. You know when they like you go like a like a during the summer when like the dude comes a candy man or like the ice cream guy comes and gives you like the the the, the catcher's mitt with the ball in it. <laughs> like this is the worst thing he can hand you. Oh, you want a SpongeBob popsicle? Here, have this instead. <laughs> All right. Coming in. I don't bite the whole thing. Save because we're gonna do a little slice at the end okay, yeah, for yeah. Franken. How is that? It's not bad at all. I mean, have you had Greek yogurt before? That's pretty similar to that. <laughs> <laughs> I like this actually. Um, great. It's like a push-up pop. You know yeah, I mean? Jessica Owen says the log is essentially a popsicle. Here you go, one bite. People also, now there's a new, um, oh, oh, that, that's actually good. <laughs> right. um, there's now lore in the chat that Carly doesn't have a shadow. <laughs> Lisa Marie O'Keefe says she doesn't even have a shadow. Oh, there's a lot like, of lights <laughs> in here, guys. Carly's a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta tell Carly she's back. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, great. Okay, so Carly's rinsing out the the ice cream maker. Yeah. I love how the Yonawas has just been sitting <laughs> on this table. Just the most useless thing in existence. I'm getting to the Cheeto right now. It's good. Honestly, the log is good also. I'm actually eating this thing. You need to stop. <laughs> this, this might be the worst thing for my bowels imaginable. <laughs> it's just a giant log of dairy with Cheetos in it. Um, it is a log of dairy. A hunk, a hunk of burning dairy. That's what that is. Um, we're gonna do, so next up to finish off our stream, we're gonna do a Franken bowl. You know, it has frozen, frozen Cheeto. It's a lot soggier than you would think. Yeah, thank you, Carly. Thank you, Carly. Thank you, Carly. Right. The chat thinks you don't have a shadow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah. Okay, great. I'm just a cryptid. I'm <laughs> <laughs> um, so we are going to make a Franken ice cream, Franken sorbet. Here, Ty, you need a, you need another napkin. What happened to every napkin? I hand you napkins, and I don't know where they go. I don't know where they go either. Um, <laughs> so we're gonna make a Franken sorbet. So can we believe that we've gotten this far in the stream? Honestly, <laughs> it's pretty. It's pretty. It's been pretty successful. I think it hit train wreck pretty fast, but the like intense planning beforehand has really gotten us to this point. Actually. <laughs> All right, ready? <laughs> so Franken, let's do it. Get a little bit of um. A little bit of everything. The log. Oh, well, what should we start with? We should go in order. Okay. Yeah. Let's do strawberry, banana. Uh, yeah, that'd be a uh, one strawberry, banana, tomato, cucumber, avocado, uh, Greek yogurt, and Cheeto ice cream coming up. All right, up. ready? Here's yeah. one strawberry. Yeah, one strawberry. Oh. Down the hatch. Here's that log of banana that I wanted to put in the whole time, yeah. but now it's soggy. <laughs> log of banana. Redemption arc. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, I'm um, getting some spice right now, actually, from all that Cheeto. You were just eating that thing. <laughs> I know. I, hey. Here's some tomatoes. Did you eat just the log by itself? Yeah, I was oh, just, yeah. Oh. Yeah, it was, it was, uh, it was good. It was good. Um, to people who came in late, we are now doing a, like, Franken concoction. One of everything. Of, w include, to include one of each of the things we already put through the ice cream machine. Right. So if you didn't see all the things that went in, this is kind of like the recap. Previously on Gilmore Girls, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm, I feel like I'm not hitting on a lot of things. All right. That's, no, you're doing a great job. Cucumber, avo. Yeah. And then we need a little bit of that. Give me the right. the key right. bag. Uh, should we show this getting chopped or is that not? It? Yeah, I don't know. Ready? Is it interesting? Well, uh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> no, that actually was kind of. All right. Come on. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Hugh Miller is making a uh, friends Rachel. Uh, what's that thing called? Oh, it's a trifle. The trifle this joke. This is the trifle. Yeah, right. <laughs> Whipped cream, lady fingers, then beef sautéed with peas and onions. <laughs> <laughs> More lady fingers. Yeah, exactly. Uh, cool. All right. <laughs> then let's do it. Let's uh, make right. good. Franken sorbet. Ready? No. Yes. All right. Yeah. Let's do this. Oh, that is upsetting. Ah! Ready, shake it. Like Here. a boy. Right there. Yeah, there it is. Oh, oh that is upsetting. Okay. Oh, right, we need more bananas to push it through. Bananas? Yeah, bananas seem like a safe one to push it through. I don't. Aren't, aren't bananas gloopy? No, but I just need it. I think that, that you can't get all the way. Yeah, yeah it, get, it gets stuck in there. It gets stuck at some point. So let's uh, use the bananas as. Um, oh, wait, I did not mean to do that. Uh -oh. What did you just do? <laughs> All right, ready? And. Yeah. Here, if I hold it, it goes through. Ready? Yeah. It's going. It's going. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> it's not for lack of effort that I am weirded out. It is almost for. It's from the effort. It's from <laughs> surplus of effort. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, we look so shiny, man. What's yeah. wrong with us? I don't know. I don't even. I don't. Am I sweaty in real life? Look at me. <laughs> I don't know. I, we're doing a lot of physical <laughs> activities right now I'm, with our. Thing. I'm annoyed. All right, yeah. so. <laughs> That is the Franken mixture. Yeah, it looks delicious. 
Oh my god. The green that is That actually really looks horrifying. Unpleasant. Show show yeah. Allie what that looks like. Oh no. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah, people are so grossed out by that that Anisha Wendy says it looks like you put a human in there. Hannah Ooh. S says, please, it looks like spam, ew. You requested this! <laughs> <laughs> you guys. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty bad. This is, oh no. Oh, I think I got a little bit of everything on it. What's that song that everyone is tired of at this point? Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. It's been on your TikTok for months <laughs> and your reels for weeks. <laughs> and it's just invaded your feed. <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah. No! Oh. Okay. No, I'll do it. I'm I'm like, okay. I need to put mind over matter here. Yeah. Ready? Cheers. Frank and Sorbet. Oh. <laughs> okay. Maybe I got a good bite. I got banana tomato. Oh. Which was not that bad. That makes sense, because I got cucumber, <laughs> avocado. I got, um, you know what it tasted like? Mine tasted like old California roll. Like old, like it felt, right? Because it, it's those things. It was like wet and soggy California roll. Oh. The, the cucumber taste as well. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I did not enjoy that. <laughs> Second bite, here we go. Now that you said that, that's all I can do. <laughs> <laughs> I love, well actually, I'll be honest, I like sushi a lot. I'm not a big California roll fan because I just don't like artificial crab that much. But I actually, I, I also, I am like a, I'm not in any way a sushi like snob. I don't know even good, like I don't know like what is, like I like grocery store sushi. Right, you know what yeah, I'm saying? I got gotcha. you. This tastes like a couple days old grocery store sushi. Yeah, it's pretty. The <laughs> tomato is reading like fish roe, like fish eggs. Yeah. Oh. And the cucumber taste is in there? Yeah, no, it, 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 that's what it is. And then you have like w like random crunches. Crab Cr stick. Crab stick, yeah. Because I mean like, yeah. It kind of like tastes like, like K-R-A-B, like crab stick. You know, like fake crab stick. <laughs> Wait, no, don't put that, in. Oh, okay, you put that there. I'm gonna put my dessert. All right. Here. All right, well. We well, we did it. <laughs> you guys, we did it for you. I'm sure everyone enjoyed that. Well, listen, so we did the Amazon vegetable slicers and it was a lot of fun because sometimes you see these weird things on the internet, you want to try them out. So we went, we got the peeler, excellent, it was fun. We tried those things. We saw this thing on TikTok. We wanted to give TikTok a shot here. Try it out, see what they got. And I felt- <laughs> Like how you're presenting this, like <laughs> this is what TikTok sent up. <laughs> <laughs> we decided to give TikTok, TikTok a shot. TikTok a chance. No, but as the guy on TikTok, listen, obviously like, I think he's fabricating how good it tastes in some ways. Um, I think that if you want like a unsweetened smoothie, hey, this is right up your alley. Yeah. But I will say, you know, I think we went, we were Icarus here. We flew too high, right? W what do you think was the, the closest we got to the sun before we fell? <laughs> <laughs> like, what was the good one? <laughs> no, to be fair though, it, we were kind of like a, uh, like a uh, parabola. Right. Icarus, right? Like there a zero was, there was high plane. points and there's some low points, right? Yeah. The high point I think was definitely actually the Cheeto. Um, the Cheeto breadstick, the, the Cheeto, Cheeto log. Greek, Greek stick, yeah. The Cheeto stick, yeah, was a high point. That was the high point. The cucumber was pretty good. Yes. Maybe peel it next time. The avocado was was horrifying. The tomato was probably the best. Right. Okay. I kind of um, think the tomato, like ice, the tomato shaved ice was probably the best. The Franken one, um, I feel sabotaged by the chat on that one. Because <laughs> not only it's our fault for making that our thing. <laughs> Um, just was was horrific, and you know what's funny is that there are so many solid Franken things we've made in the in life. <laughs> you know, whether it be lipsticks or cakes or like cake batter all mixed <laughs> together, uh, this was the worst one. Mm. Yeah. Sophia yeah. and Tyler revealing what goes inside of a chicken McNugget. I saw I'm using that from the chat. Yeah, that I'll is. Do that. Natasha Slocum says we got a Franken scream and Carly lore all in all a successful stream. <laughs> right? Yeah, we are. We are building this lore out. Right? It was really just reveal Carly's a vampire. No, that yeah. was really just what it is. <laughs> Carly who? Carly Cullen. <laughs> um, awesome. Great. So yeah, then Stephanie Adcox is just spamming. What made you guys do this? Do you need help? So that's what's happening. The, in the answer chat right is now. sure. <laughs> We, sure, we probably we could use we help. Could, yeah, probably always. Um, yeah, we could use help. That's what I was going for. You know, you see something on TikTok, it rustles the jimmies, right? You get kind of <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think. <laughs> 
does that mean like it makes you interested in something? Maybe, yeah. Maybe, it okay. also could mean it gets you aroused, but that's fine. It did not make me aroused, <laughs> no. <laughs> um, this is just like uh, oh. foot meets mouth, the stream, Tyler, <laughs> Tyler edition. Um, Overall, yeah. I actually thought this was pretty fun. I'm glad that we got this. I'm glad we tried it out. I think that we horrified everyone yeah. by almost purposefully making bad things. Right. But um, overall, I'm pleased. Yeah, I think it was cool. Yes. So if you like this stream and you want to see more streams like it, you can smash that or gently tap that like button. And if you uh, want to see more streams like this, you can also I know this right. You can also <laughs> smash that subscribe <laughs> button because um, we're going to do this every Tuesday at 5 p.m. Eastern. Yes. Um, I just want to say, I'm also, we're kicking this thing out. This, the fake one is no. a negative. Yeah, the <laughs> fake one, Yonawis is out. No. Yonanis is in. <laughs> Yonawis is out. One day, you're, you're now sin. The next, you're now. You're, you're now, <laughs> right? <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. You want to, uh, let's play it out. Let's play it out. Let's figure out All the right. outro. Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, here are our social media handles. Yeah. There they are. Thank you. Pull those graphics in here, baby. Um, and then here is our TikTok, um, where we found this cursed object. Um, and you might even see some more Yonanus on there, maybe. We might film some more after this. Yeah. Um, so thank you guys so much for hanging out. I hope you guys had a fun stream. I hope you guys aren't too grossed out. I hope you guys aren't too upset by any of Tyler's puns. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> what pun what is it? Oh, oh, that last one I just did. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler immediately forgot. <laughs> just blacked out. I wish I could forget. <laughs> <laughs> and um, we will see you guys uh, next time.